Hey guys, welcome back to our channel. It's a girl and Lungu back with another reaction video. If you're new to this channel, make sure to give this video a thumbs up, share it with your friends, and of course, don't forget to subscribe. Like I said, my name is Fanny Lungu, and on this channel, we post reaction videos. Other than reaction videos, we've also got a second YouTube channel called Funny Angels 2.0. You can head there and just enjoy the content that's there. We also do other things which if you go to the description box you'll find the links to everything else that we do and you can just enjoy whatever we put out there uh, a big shout out to the person that suggested this and thank you to everyone that's been subscribing commenting giving us things to do interacting with us giving us more knowledge or educating us more whatever the case is we thank you guys very much i hope you guys are doing all right so without wasting time today we'll be reacting to I'll be reacting to the last few words of Prophet Muhammad emotional. So without wasting time, let's get into the video. By the time of Isha, he could not move. And when he could not move, it is like ten men together could not move not like when you or when I I don't know about you Allah, or when I fall sick and I think I can't move when probably I could move he could not move and he lost consciousness he woke up for a moment and the first thing he said the first thing he said did people perform their salah? Aisha, our mother in whose presence he died she said la ya rasulallah fa innahum fintizarik no, Ya Rasulullah, they are still waiting for you. They have hope. Then he said, Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam, bring me al makhzab this big vessel with water, cool, fresh water. He entered inside of it and he refreshed himself and bathed and got out to get some strength and as he stood up to walk to inside the masjid he fell and he lost consciousness he wakes up a while later the first thing he says he tries that again washes and tries to get up and he can't and he falls thrice Finally, he appointed Abu Bakr in Radiallahu Ta'ala to lead Salatul Isha. And Abu Bakr as Siddiq led Salatul Isha of Thursday night and the Fajr Salah of Monday and three days in between. The scholars say about 17. Salawat were led by Abu Bakr in the presence of Rasulullah sallallahu alayhi wa alihi wa sahbihi wa sallam. And that means a lot for those who think and reflect. Monday morning. Fajr time. Abu Bakr radiallahu ta'ala anna is the Imam of the believers. Suddenly, suddenly, the curtain opens. 
from the private quarters of Aisha radiallahu ta'ala anha and that door opened directly into the masjid in the front rows of the masjid. The curtain is open and Rasulullah sallallahu alayhi wa sallam is standing at that door seeing Abu Bakr radiallahu an leading his ummah in salah. The last sight from this dunya excuse me of Rasulullah sallallahu alayhi wa alihi wa sahbihi wa sallam was his ummah in salah. His ummah united in salah. That was the last sight of his ummah. They were so elated, so happy. Qala Anas kadu yuftatanuna fi salatihim. Farahan bi Rasulillah. Out of joy, Rasulullah sallallahu alayhi wa sallam now is healed. They thought he came to lead us again. No, he did not. When he looked at them, he smiled. Tabassama wa He smiled. And then he closed the curtain. And went back. Until duha time. His beautiful in every way daughter Fatima alayha salam wa radiallahu anha came to him and he called her and whispered a few words in her ears and she wept. And he called her again and he whispered a few words in her noble ears and she smiled. Later she knew she was to say that the first few words he whispered into my ears were, I will die. She wept. The next words he whispered in her ears were, you will be the first one of my household to join me. She smiled. And yes, six months later, she joined him. last, very last seconds or minutes. Abdul Rahman ibn Abi Bakr radiallahu ta'ala anhuma enters the private quarters of Rasulullah sallallahu alayhi wa alihi wa sahbihi wa sallam. And he's laying in the arms of Aisha against her noble chest. And Abu Ba'an Abdul Rahman was carrying a miswak. Rasulullah sallallahu alayhi wa sallam said Aisha who read, who read with her eyes of her head and her eyes of her heart every move external and internal of Rasulullah sallallahu alayhi wa sallam it seems she said I knew as he looked at Abdul Rahman, that he perhaps wanted siwak. At that moment, Ya Rasulullah, at that moment, she said, I told him, would you like the siwak, Ya Rasulullah? He moved his head, yes. 
she took it from him and, and then she never forgot this to be one of her most special privileges with Rasulullah sallallahu alayhi wa sallam qalat ikhtala tariqi biriqihi inda mawti my saliva mixed with his at the moment of his death for she said to him as the siwak was hard she said shall I soften it for you he moved his head yes she took it in her noble sweet mouth and softened it softened it and gave it to him and he took it in his mouth right after that and said moved his sweet lips and Aisha said he said مع الذين أنعمت عليهم من النبيين والصديقين والشهداء والصالحين اللهم اغفر لي وارحمني اللهم الرفيق الأعلى اللهم الرفيق الأعلى اللهم الرفيق الأعلى with those whom you graced from among the Nabiyeen and the Muqarrabeen and the Shuhda and the Salihin oh Allah forgive me oh Allah grant me rahmah of the Most High. Oh Allah, the company of the Most High. Oh Allah, the company of the Most High. I love you, Rasulullah. Brothers and sisters, As-Salah wa dhikru al-Mawt Akthiru min dhikri hadhi min lathat Remember often the destroyer of passions said he to us sallallahu alayhi wa sallam remember more often death my dear brothers and sisters it will give you 
more life. موتوا قبل أن تموتوا. As he said. For those who understand this language. For yes, we evolve and we change and we mature. His level was for the muqarrabun, for the salihun, for the seekers of the gate of love of Allah and His Rasul. Mutu qabla an tamutu. Die before you die. Die away from the nafs, from the appetites of the nafs. From the hawa of the nafs. The last words of the sweetest of all human beings were these words. As salah, as salah, as salah. That was really something to react to or come across. Like I always say, big shout out to the people that are making sure we come across such videos. This was indeed very emotional. At the end of the day, what the Prophet wants you to do is to remember the prayer. Remember to pray. There is something that happens when you pray. Whatever you speak in prayer may come to be given that you're giving it your all or rather you really mean whatever you're saying in prayer otherwise like i said this was an emotional video and thank you for suggesting this make sure to give this if you have anything to say make um you can leave a comment in the section below and just we'll read whatever you post um make sure to give this video a thumbs up share it with your friends and of course do not forget to subscribe and i'll see you in my next reaction video